how can you make sure that the person actually visited exactly that store, you know, com compared to maybe passing by? The way you know for sure that somebody was there is using the beacon technology. And uh, as you suggested, it's not the most scalable because it requires that, uh, uh, you know, stores or somebody with uh, access to a lot of infrastructure goes and puts these be beacons everywhere, right? Yeah. I respectfully and, disagree yeah. on that, actually, yeah. <laughs> I think there's so much more. I think that that is one piece to the puzzle, but there are a number of other ways in which you can determine if someone is actually in a location versus passing by, which is a massive discrepancy when you're trying to reach those people in real time. Right. And you can do that if you're able to provide stop detection, and you have that always on panel with people utilizing these apps. The thing that I think where this industry has to go um, and this is something that uh, we've launched and um, is similar to what happened in viewability and that fraud and all of that stuff, it's a big topic these days, um, is pay only when somebody visits the store. And I disagree with you on that. <laughs> I knew she was going to say that. <laughs> Visits are very important and it depends on where you're getting your visit attribution if it's incentivized, if it penalizes and normalizes against the U.S. Census and so forth. There's so much more to visits than just the actual visit. There is the lift and everything that comes with that as well. I think cost per visit is really interesting. Um, and it's a really interesting way if, if you are very focused on that visit metric for, for measurement. Um, we work with customers, though, who often have a lot of different KPIs that they want to accomplish. And I think um, when you're looking at location data, it's a lot more than just did you drive someone to a retailer. There's a lot of insights and behavioral aspects that location tells you about who a customer is. Uh, we've got to just start looking at you know, what are the actual KPIs on, on the other end because anybody can, you know, I could go start a location company tomorrow and go scrape all of your websites and, you know, it's the classic seven minute abs versus six minute abs where more accurate than four square and we've got, they've got 200 million devices, we've got 205 million now, right? But if you just put that up on a slide and the output of that is just media, then it's pretty tough for you to, you all to, to evaluate what's real, what's not, what's important, what's not important, what are the nuances I need to focus on.